Are we live? Are we on TV? Yeah, yes. I'm, um... Actually, I'm starting his television show at the moment. Okay. Um, it's Thugs Bunny TV. If you've got Instagram, please follow Thugs Bunny. T-H-U-G-Z Bunny TV. Um, I wrote a movie, and uh, he's actually... Do I'm, doing I'm doing a couple of comedies, um, doing entertainment news, and um, video game streaming. Simultaneously, He's always wanted his credit for directing all these videos, so I'm finally gonna give him his light. So my new productions, I'm letting him do his thing, give him his credit, you know what I'm saying? I'm heavily into video games. I actually developed my own video game. I was thinking before I did him or doing the movie, my other option was a video game that I designed. So Doug's Bunny show, he actually has monthly streaming with uh, video game fans. I also have a name in the video game industry. I, I am a part of the OGC run by OB1. It's called the OGC. It stands for OB's Gaming Championships and it's owned by OB1. He's one of the biggest Nintendo YouTubers. He's actually Jamaican as well. You know what I mean? And um, people know Thugs Bunny really from there and I'm working on doing video game reviews and monthly streaming. A lot of the artists here love video games as well. And if they don't, I'm gonna have to buy them an Xbox or a Switch and have them come play with Thugs Bunny once a month and talk about interviews and video games like that. So his show is actually based, it's like a lounge. We're gonna hang out, play video games and talk about the industry, you know, and fan, let fans be able to interact and talk to the artists and have fun playing video games once a month. <laughs> I did a lot of small skits. Before I started doing music videos, I did some comedies, just playing on Belizean cultures and things like that. I actually wrote an entire movie called um, Andy Bennett's Hard Times. And it was basically about um, me as an American meeting a girl in Belize and going back there and having trouble adapting to the cultures. And a lot of jokes are about the American getting adapted to bush life, you know, a lot of jokes are on that. But being that a movie is very expensive, I kind of put it in the trash. Not put it in the trash, but put it aside. Mm -hmm. Making music videos is an art, just like writing music. It's fun and it's very artistic. I put a lot of thought into every creation I do. Simultaneously, being an artist, you're never completely satisfied until you're doing your own creations. So even though I enjoy bringing music to life, I'm never, I've, I feel like there's things that I, in my head that the world needs to see. So now this is just an opportunity for me to satisfy that, uh, that uh, craving to be artistic, you know? For me, Thugs Bunny, I'll say I've been the invisible hand for many years, but people are just seeing my face. You know, I did a video on my Instagram with Renee 630 big up wherever you at, up, up, up. It's almost, you know, I never knew the process of making a puppet, and it's almost like having a child, like a birth certificate and everything, because it's licensed and everything like that. Do you care for it? Like, well, I have to keep him in his bag at all times, because think about it, if somebody spills a drink on him, or you can't really clean it. So I try to keep him covered at all times when, when I'm bringing him out, you know. Sometimes people think it's a, a toy. I'm handsome, and I got this fire edge up for my barber, Powis. See that? Look that edge up, all okay. smooth. I do have um, more characters coming out, but I do want to focus on Thugs Bunny. I actually have three characters. I'm sorry, I just forgot to mention him. His, I can mention his name. His name is Def Chewbacca. Okay. And Def Chewbacca is, he has his own show. And his show, Def Chewbacca, is Thugs Bunny's favorite show. The sexy women? Yeah, I Like you? That. Wait, 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 are you single though? No. Sorry. Dang, <laughs> how long you had that problem? <laughs> she got that same problem. Damn, it's contagious out here. It depends on the situation. I like to dress comfortable in my classic Heavy Films t-shirt and my Heavy Films hat. Heavy Films, that's what the hats say. I'm on the gleaner, having a relaxed day. Chilling interview, having a track play, cruising down halfway, trees in an ashtray. 